seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Are you listening? Ricky J. Sports. What is going on, my fellow YouTubers? This is Ricky J, baby, from Ricky J Sports, and welcome to my prediction fight video on the McGregor versus Mayweather fight. And I am so pumped up for this fight. I just finished watching the Toronto press conference, and I'm from Toronto, and that was crazy, man. Seeing them go back and forth, you gotta love McGregor because in the first press conference in LA, they shut off McGregor's mic, and he was not happy with that. So he came back with a vengeance, man. But in this video, I wanna just break it down. Uh, while this is going on, I am fighting live right now in an online rank match, championship match. I am Conor McGregor, and I'm gonna get right to it. We heard Marshall Mind break down his thoughts on the fight, and he did a great job t telling all of us that he feels that Mayweather is going to win. He just feels like he has all the tools to to beat McGregor, and McGregor doesn't have any experience when, with respect to boxing. But I am going to go on the other side. I feel like McGregor is going to win. Call me crazy. Call me what you want. But he has a unique style, and that style, that length that McGregor has is, go is going to ultimately give him that key to victory oh yes I feel like he's gonna come out in an MMA stance not the traditional boxing stance and he's also not gonna throw a lot of volume punches he's gonna throw where he sees openings and I feel like his ability to slip and move is going to help him and he's going to catch Mayweather at some point and I think when Mayweather feels the power of McGregor that's when Mayweather is gonna hit the panic button remember Mayweather hasn't fought for two years and McGregor is a hungry lion going into his athletic prime, man. So I know you guys are going to call me crazy, but I feel like McGregor is going to win, just like he said, within the first four rounds. I'm going to say within the first five rounds. Now, the only thing, there's a lot of things that could go wrong with respect to McGregor's side, but I feel like his cardio is what's going to slow him down, if it does. But I still feel like he's going to get the victory. But if there's one thing that's going to slow him down, it's his cardio. I don't think Mayweather can hurt him. And McGregor's used to getting hit with, you know, MMA gloves and getting hit by boxing gloves is obviously a lot different. A lot of people were saying, though, that, Ricky, you don't know what you're talking about, that I was talking to some friends in person, real life people, and they were saying that the boxing gloves are going to negate the power of McGregor. And I don't think so, man. I think that he's still going to pack a punch and he will catch him with that that left hand shot man maybe not just one shot but he's gonna catch him and surprise Mayweather I really feel that that's the case so here we go I'm gonna try to box the best I can in this fight but if my opponent starts you know really laying the kicks on me and tries to take me down I'm going to uh, you know turn this into an MMA fight but for now we're gonna turn this into a boxing match But it's exciting, though. It's the biggest fight ever, man, which is crazy. And I'm just so happy that we're all alive to witness this. You know what I mean? Like, to just be alive later on in life to say that we were there, man. We witnessed it. I don't agree with the pay-per-view cost, though. Ariel Hawani was doing an interview with the Showtime guys. And I love Ariel how he, um, he was trying to pry some information out of them. And he was saying, how much is the pay-per-view going to be? And it's not going to be the typical, you know, UFC cost. It's going to be a hundred bucks, man. Hundred bucks American, I believe. So us Canadians, it's going to be over a hundred bucks. So if you guys are going to watch it, which I know you guys are, make sure to invite as many people as you want <laughs> or as you can to offset the cost. It's not that bad, but still, they know everyone's going to pay for it. Oh boy. So I got to be careful here. I do not want to lose on my prediction video. But I will post it even if I do. Looking for the head kick. Clean head kick lands. Joe, he doesn't start to defend these But I've been thinking about it for a long time and I'm still sticking with McGregor, man. I really feel so confident. And if I'm wrong, I'm happy to admit it, but I've been watching the Mayweather fights, and I don't know, man. Just have a a good feeling about McGregor. And McGregor thrives. Like he's obviously he's a better puncher than kicker, but you some people would say, but he's never fought like a really good boxer. But still, if he only has to worry about Mayweather's hands, he's gonna be fine. Nice block, and he counters with the jab. 
That would be funny though if McGregor starts losing and he just starts kicking in the fight. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> or if he goes for a takedown. He would get disqualified, obviously. And I'm trying to rush this fight too. I don't want it to go five rounds, man. I don't want to make this video too long. I know you guys came here for the prediction. And I want you to stick around. But the cool thing though, the boxing match is three 12 minute rounds. And you know McGregor's not used to that. Uh, you know, in the UFC, if you guys are just boxing guys and you don't know about the UFC, it's for championship fights, it's five five minute rounds, which is 25 minutes. But in boxing, it's a 36 minute fight. But the good thing about, because uh, people harp on McGregor's cardio, is that he only has to work hard for three minutes. Then he gets that one minute break. You know what I mean? <laughs> if it was pride, pride. Pride back in the day with the first round was 10 minutes. Yeah. Really going with that left hand. Oh, wow. Got to back away. That's another thing. Will McGregor back away if he does get hurt? Or will his pride just make him want to bang? And again, I'm just trying to box in this match. Yeah. Oh, I gotta stop doing the jab straight. He's picking up on it. Let's go. Pace has slowed down. It's okay. This my opponent's gonna gas himself out eventually. Rocked again, people. <laughs> That's okay. Keep on moving. Keep on moving. I pull a Mayweather. Yeah. That's a big right hand. Powerful left hand shots. Oh boy. Solid jab. Vicious combination. Yeah, I gotta use that straight a little bit more. Keep on laying that left-handed bomb on him. See that kicking. He doesn't have obviously he doesn't have to worry about that kicking, but that kicking's giving me problems. Oh. I'm tagging him. Even though I got hurt. Yeah. Oh, I heard him. Oh, wow. The tables were turned after that at the end of that round. And let's see if we could do something positive in this next round, man. Like I said, I don't want this video to be too long. Don't want it to be too long, but hopefully you guys are enjoying this little McGregor showcase. And I feel like I'm doing better by attacking with my straight a little bit more. Oh boy. This guy's attacking my body. Oh. That's how you get KO'd. Nice, nice little slip action. Just gotta touch him. Just gotta touch him. I'm nervous. Oh. 
Just gotta touch him. Tickle the belly a little bit too. Yeah. Hit him up. Yeah. The tide has been turned since I've been using the old straight action as my primary weapon, as my primary lead. Oh, skids on the canvas. I didn't want to go on top of him. Let's go, big boy. Let's go. Oh, he walked right into that one. Oh, he's going for the body now. He's going for the old body. Oh, no. Oh, he's letting me up. Oh, he's doing the Ali shuffle. What a battle. What a battle. Oh man, I thought I got out of that. This is raw, unedited. An unedited battle. And the heart of McGregor will hopefully power him through this. Yeah, belly tickle action. Man. Now I could weasel out and start kicking in the next round. Oh boy, if I can make it there. No way, Jose. But I think I'm going to continue boxing, people. What a battle. What a battle. Now, another thing, too, is Mayweather obviously is a heavy favorite. Like, he's going into this, you know, going into his world. McGregor is going out of his world into Mayweather's world. And if Mayweather starts struggling, man, the psychological aspect of the fight is really going to play mind games with him. You know what I mean? And then... I could see the crowd being pro McGregor too. Will the crowd have an effect on him? And I am in a fight here, folks. It's not fair. I could only box. And I gotta be a little more conservative with my strikes, man, to kind of pull this out. I really have to. Powerful jab. Combination. Powerful right hand. Doing a decent job recovering. Let's go, big boy. What a jab. Nicely timed straight. Let's go. I got the stamina advantage. Joey did a nice job blocking that punch. A good slip and rip by Pettis. He's still going for that body. I could see it though. Let's go. Nice kick, Joe. That's okay. You keep on doing that. Gotta be happy with his performance tonight. He's landing some big shots in this fight, and that's why I have him ahead. Nice jab. Big roundhouse kick. Joey commented on it. Oh, I did not mean to kick there. Once again, the utilization of the jab. Oh no. Oh. Oh, he's landing. Hit him hard. Oh, McGregor's fighting back. Beautiful body shot there too. Man, not too many more kicks. Hard jab. To the body and I'm done. Oh. Big punch is landing. No way. Yes. <laughs> Bully forward. Man, oh boy. Eyes have started to swell now. 
And he connects here. The hook blocked by Pettis. Let's go. And connects with the jab. Very nice timing with these shots. Oh! This is turning into be an epic fight, man. Big straight punch. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. Oh, that one hurt him. It was supposed to just be a prediction video, but now this is turning into some craziness. Nice jab. That huge head kick was blocked. Strong right by McGregor. He continues to connect with those punches. He scores with a huge left. Big power jab. Oh no! Oh, <laughs> what a fight! <laughs> and the alley shuffle, like, you gotta love my opponent. Before I forget, let me know in the comment section below how you think the Mayweather McGregor fight's gonna end. And we are in a battle. Do I just turn to MMA style right now? Man, I'm really tempted to do so, but we're not. We're not. We're sticking to our boxing guns. And if you're still sticking around here, thank you so much for sticking around this long into the video. I gotta catch him when he misses. Getting him. Good, solid, straight right. He doesn't have a lot of steam left. Oh, wow, and rocked again. How many times have I been rocked? McGregor in survival mode. I gotta switch stands. Oh, baby, what a fight. Oh, I heard him. Oh, boy. Oh, we both have no gas tank left. I think in the last two minutes, I'm turning MMA style. I'm going for it. Oh, that's a great block of the punch. Wow. What a fight. Okay, MMA style, people. Here we go. Oh, the smell it to the head. Swing and a miss. Big combination. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. This is shot to the body. Look at this. This is this is Oh, he's hurt. Oh, he hurt. He is in big trouble here. Body kick, look at that. Wow, he is getting off some massive kicks. Oh, McGregor. He is just. Oh, it's over. It's got to be over. What a fight, people. I kind of cheesed out there at the end by going MMA in the last two minutes. But there you have it. A prediction and an epic battle. My right leg is shaking. I need to calm down. So there you have it, people. Let me know your prediction. The McGregor Mayweather Big time fight. And like I said, McGregor's going to win, man. He's going to win within the first four or five rounds. Guarantee. Mark my word. You heard it here at Ricky J Sports. Anyhow, people, thank you so much for stopping by. This is Ricky J, baby, from Ricky J Sports. And you are us. Check out this angle here.